Hello and greetings to all from Toronto, Canada. My name is Olena Derwich. I am a registered psychotherapist in the province of Ontario and a registered Canadian art therapist. As a clinician during the past two years, I have been facilitating group digital art therapy sessions for adults with autism at the Lawson Ministries Hamilton Autism Centre. Individuals with autism tend to display difficulties in communication, imagination, social engagement, and cognitive executive functioning. During today's presentation, I will briefly describe the group DAT program at Lawson. I implement the group DAT sessions within the Paparilla Innovative Arts Centre at Lawson. The images on slide two provide viewers a glimpse into the centre's main floor, open concept and wheelchair accessible space, which is bright and well ventilated. The first two years of the program was funded by Unity for Autism, a Canadian national granting body. And the program is now a permanent weekly fee-for-service program at Lawson. The group DAT program at Lawson provides adults with moderate to high functioning autism an opportunity to create digital art on password protected touchscreen laptops using a variety of art making apps. The program is best suited for individuals with high sensory sensitivities who prefer creating in a mess free texture-free artistic environment. While creating digital art, participants have an opportunity to engage in dialogues with the art therapist and other group members regarding their daily activities, emotions, hopes, favorite interests, and upcoming family and community events. Slide four presents the framework of the group DAT sessions. Each year, I implement three cycles of 12 weekly semi-structured group DAT sessions. To date, 25 adults with autism have participated in the program. The program is grounded in person-centered and strengths-based theoretical approaches, as well as Yellum's group therapeutic factors. The primary goal of the program is to awaken the adults' imaginative thinking abilities strengthening their executive function skills such as color and pattern recognition skills, develop their confidence level with new digital media, and establish friendships with other adults with autism. Slide 5 outlines the digital equipment and apps used. During the sessions, each member works on one designated password protected 15-inch Dell Inspirium Windows 10 touchscreen laptop and has the opportunity to create digital art using the following three easy to use art making apps. Fresh Paint, Zen Coloring Book for Adults, which is a mandala based app, and Coloring by Numbers for Adults. Group members also have the opportunity to use the following three creative cognitive activity apps, Flow Free, Puzzle Touch, and Memory Images in order to maintain and solidify their color and pattern recognition skills, sequencing skills, and visual memory abilities. Group members have a choice to create their digital art with a round tip stylus or their index finger. Two printers are present in the room for instant printing for digital artwork, an all-in-one HB printer, as well as a Canon photo printer. Slide six highlights the art-based interventions from the field of art therapy that are frequently administered to group members during the ses sessions in a non-sequential format. The scribble drawing, the house tree person, a favorite kind of day, draw mandala, free drawing, and the interactive drawing test, which encourages group members to interact and create on the digital canvas with the art therapist or another member of the group. The top image exemplifies an untitled digital free drawing created by one of the group members using fresh paint. The bottom left image depicts a digital mandala created by another group member using the Zen Coloring Books for Adults app. While the bottom right image presents a digital painting depicting another group member's favorite kind of day, that of making and eating homemade pizza. The next slide presents three overarching themes that have emerged from the direct session observations. The first is exposure to new digital activities. 
prior to enrolling in the group DAT sessions, a few group members were preoccupied with playing digital games and or watching YouTube videos. The group DAT sessions allow these adults with autism to engage with more meaningful digital creative activities. The second theme is fostering executive function skills. By engaging with the digital art making and creative activity apps, group members are able to maintain and improve their color and pattern recognition skills, as well as their concentration, problem solving, sequencing, and visual memory skills. The third theme is connecting with others. The group sessions allow the adults with autism to engage in one-on-one -on -one dialogues with the art therapist and other group members within an intimate five-member group setting. Slide 8 highlights some of the benefits and limitations of the group DAT sessions. One benefit is that less setup and takedown time of art media is required by the art therapist. A second benefit is that less storage space is required for the digital media compared to traditional art media. And a third benefit is that the Windows 10 PC allows the therapist to create password protected folders for each client. As for limitations, the digital canvas is a fragile device, hence limited to individuals who do not exhibit aggressive behavior or apply heavy stylus pressure on the touchscreen. A second limitation is that all, not all art making and creative activity apps are compatible with all digital platforms. And a third limitation is that the digital canvas provides only modest sensory stimulation for sensation seeking adults with autism. In conclusion, the group DAT sessions at Lawson bring meaning and joy to the adults with autism lives and enables them to maintain their creativity, imaginative thinking, executive function, and social engagement abilities, which are all transferable to other life settings. With the higher number of individuals with autism in North America, there is a need for art therapists in Canada, the US, and across the globe to develop innovative art therapy programs for children, adolescents, adults, and older adults with autism which promote their physical and psychological well-being. The following slides include references. And the final slide includes my e-contact details. Do email me if you have any further questions regarding the group DAT sessions at Lawson. In addition to this presentation, I have uploaded a video created by Airborne Productions that captures Peter one of the group members using the Puzzle Touch and Flow Free apps. Enjoy the video. Signing off from Canada, Elena.